All right, it's time now for Clicking in Cleveland. And for that, of course, we bring in our digital anchor, Stephanie Hayden. Hi, Stephanie. I like the combo. Thank is you. that brown? Is that is it is orange it orange and black? black? It's black. It's a little Bengalsy. I know. That's okay. I need a brown jacket. I'll pretend it's brown because right. I'm okay. mostly colorblind anyhow. <laughs> there you go. There you go. All right. Well, we're going to start with a different sports team because we're watching the Guardians very closely with the major series that's going on again with the Chicago White Sox. So the magic number is now seven. That means we need any combination of Guardians wins and White Sox losses that add up to seven for Cleveland to clinch and make it to the playoffs. Now the Guardians play the White Sox again tonight with the first pitch scheduled for 8-10 and another win drops that magic number to five. Sports fans in Cleveland better have their clickers ready to bounce back and forth between these two crucial games this and Thursday night football. Which brings us to our question of the day. Our question is, who do you think will win tonight, the Browns or the Steelers, and what do you think the score will be? On the WKYC Facebook page, Sean Heiss is obviously still mad at the defense. He says Pittsburgh wins it by six. Let's move to Twitter, where it's the opposite extreme. Dan Banks says the Browns win, and they win big, by the way. And we've got a real Goldilocks and three bears situation going on here because on the What's New Facebook page, we have moderate enthusiasm. So a few people are calling it for the Browns to win 21 to either 17 or 18. That's what Jay said earlier. Yeah. But everybody there is calling it for the Browns. Now, I'm saying Browns by three. I'm, a, I'm on with Cade York. Okay. And now I have exciting news to share. You all know that I've got my experiment going to see if it pays to play the Powerball. I've been playing once a week, every Wednesday since January, and last night, I won $200! Yay! <laughs> and only nine people won $200, by the way, so I am feeling very time? cool. Really? Yes, last night, only nine people won the 200 bucks. And now I can officially say, for me, it pays to play because now I've won more than my $156 yearly budget. Now I'm going to keep going, Jay and Betsy, to see exactly how much it pays to play, you know, because I do have that student loan debt that I'm hopefully, you know, working to pay off. But wow. I shrieked when I opened my little app this morning. <laughs> I, was, I was like, oh, I matched several. I won! Oh my God. <laughs> now you got three right in the Powerball, right? Yes, so that's what I did. So you would have needed to get six right and the Powerball. I would all five. It's five numbers oh, five. and then the okay. Powerball. It's six numbers total, total to win the whole jackpot. How far That's off were you on the on. other two? Were you I even was, close? It was, it was not close. No. It wasn't. I mean, I liked those other numbers, but they weren't my numbers. Right. Congratulations. Yeah. Are you playing Thanks. the same numbers every time or you're going auto pick? Random auto pick. Okay. So the random auto pick did me good this time. Fingers crossed. No matter what happens, you're $42 to the good. I know. I like it. I'm in the green. I assume that's a cut check to your student loans. It is. It's about half a student loan payment, so thank you. you thank go. you, Carol. <laughs> All right. Good job. Thank Yay. you.